Hi guys, remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Come into child's pose. Big toes touching, knees wide. Stretch your arms forward, take a big inhale. And a big exhale through your mouth. Ah. Another inhale through the nose. Hold. Exhale through the mouth. Ah. One more inhale. Hold. Exhale through the mouth. Let go. Ah. Really nice. Hands shoulder width apart. Knees hip width apart. Ground your fingers. Ground your knees. Take a big inhale. And a big exhale. Belly button into the spine. Straighten your arms as much as you can. Ground your knuckles. Ground your knees. Go ahead and look up to the sky. Bring the thoracic spine into the body. Straight arms. Belly button into the spine. Really nice. Go ahead and look up. Look up. Belly button into the spine. Really nice. Ground your knuckles. Ground your knees. Go ahead and look up. And look to your belly. Beautiful. Spine neutral. Come into downward dog. Work those legs back. Straight arms. Straight legs. Push the front of the thigh into the back of the thigh. Really work your legs so you can stretch out of your hands. Ground every fingertip. Ground your thumb, index, middle ring, and pinky fingers. Really nice. Stretch, stretch. We're going to create space in the body. Work the front of the thigh into the back of the thigh. Work those femurs back. Really nice, creating space between each individual vertebrae. Creating space in the body, space in the mind, space in the soul. Come onto your knees, step your right foot forward, ground your right foot, ground your left knee, interlace your fingertips. Stretch your arms forward, retract the arm bones back, reach up to the sky, lift the back ribs, the side ribs, remember to knit the floating ribs, and reach up, lift the back ribs, lift the side ribs, and go up, stretch those wrists, especially if you're using a computer a lot, hands at your heart, bring your hands down to your front foot, straighten your back leg, look straight ahead. Really nice. Ground your left hand. Bring your right hand up. Look up at your thumb. Ground your right foot. Ground your left toes. You're twisting in your abdominals, which cleanses your liver, your kidneys, your spleen. Take a big inhale. And exhale. Really nice. Come on down. Look straight ahead. Ground your back heel. Heel to heel. Bring your hands to your hips. Lift those frontal hip bones if you can. Make sure heel to heel or heel to back arch. Reach your left arm forward. Retract it back slightly. Interlace the thumbs and go up. Lift the back ribs. Lift the side ribs. Soften the floating ribs. Really nice. Stay there and breathe. Beautiful. Stay there and breathe. And for fun. Let's go ahead and try a balancing pose. Balance is so important as we age. Retract the arm bones back. The gaze, the dristies at your fingertips. Walk your back foot in and stretch. Lengthen your arms forward, your left leg back. Sparkle those fingertips. Sparkle those left toes and stretch. Get really long. Beautiful. Come back to warrior one. Straight arms. Look up. Let's clasp the hands behind the back. Squeeze your shoulder blades together and just do humble little warrior where we bring the knuckles up to the ceiling. Drop your head down and just breathe into your shoulders. Really nice. You don't have to come down so far. Go ahead and come back up to warrior one. Reach up to the sky. 
beautiful. Really nice. Let's go ahead and throw a twist in there. Hands at your heart, please. Let's go ahead and try to roll on the back toes. I like that for my pelvis. Bring your left elbow onto your right thigh and twist. Long inhalations and long exhalations. Soften your shoulders. Ground your right foot. Ground your left toes. Open up into warrior two. Extend through those arms. Reverse warrior. Go back. Really nice. Remember to breathe. Big inhales, big exhales. You can bring your forearm onto your thigh, or you can, and then bring your right arm over and stretch. If you have it in your hips, you can also bring that hand down to the floor. Yogi's choice. The gaze is at your upper pinky. And gently, as you ground your right foot and ground your left foot, roll your heart open to the heavens. Very nice. Long inhalations. Ground that back foot. As you ground that back foot, lift that inner arch of your left foot a little bit to wake up that thigh. Look at your front hand. Really nice. And then sweep that hand back down. Come back to warrior two. Beautiful. Extend through. Look at your front hand, then come right to triangle. Doing really nicely. Look up. Reach the arm over. Come to straight arm plank, please. Beautiful. Belly button in. If your wrists hurt, come onto your elbows. Bring your right knee to your right elbow. Your left to your left. Just waking up the core, right to right. You guys are doing great. Left to left. Right to right. Left to left. Right to right. Left to left. Really nice. Come on to your knees. Let's do elbow plank. Interlace your fingertips, elbows, ground your elbows, and let's do breath of fire. Here we go. Through the mouth. Really nice. Come on down. Crawl your arms forward, please. Lift your right arm and left leg. Left arm and right leg. Right arm and left leg, left arm and right leg, both arms and legs lift and lower, lift and lower, lift and lower. Really nice. Bring your hands underneath your shoulders, come into an upward cobra. You can even make a cobra sound. Come down, lift your hands a couple inches off the ground, lift your legs. Lift a little higher. Imagine your scapulas are like stamps onto a letter. Come into a cobra. Lift. Lift into cobra. Lift your hands and legs just a couple inches off the ground, waking up those erector spinae muscles. Come into upward cobra and child's pose. Take a big inhale. And a big exhale. Ah. Let it all go. Really nice. Let's go back into downward dog. Spread your fingers wide. Front of the thigh, into the back of the thigh. Straight arm, straight legs. Really front of the thigh, into the back of the thigh. Belly button in. Stretch. Big inhale. And exhale. You can even exhale through the mouth. Inhale. Exhale through the mouth. Ah. Oh, let it all go. Inhale. Exhale. Ah. Oh, when you make an audible exhale, it works the vagus nerve and just really soothes and gets rid of any psychological gunk. Inhale. Exhale. Ah. Let go of all your worries, your fears, your stresses. Come onto your knees. Left foot forward, please. Hands onto your thigh. Belly button in. Interlace the fingertips the other way if you can. Stretch your wrists. Bring your 
arms into your shoulder, in, arms back into the shoulder girdle, and reach up. Lift the back ribs, lift the side ribs, knit the floating ribs down as you lift your back ribs and your side ribs really nice. Hands in prayer. Bring your hands down to your front foot. Straighten your back leg, please. And go ahead and reach your left arm up. You guys are doing great. Look up. Long inhalations and long exhalations. Soften your shoulders. Reach up. Twisting in the abdominals that cleanses the liver, the kidneys, and the spleen. Bring the hand back down, please. Ground your back heel. Heel to heel or front heel to back arch. Yogi's choice, whatever feels good. Really nice. Bend that left knee for warrior one. Reach your right arm forward. Retract your arm bone back ever so slightly. Interlace the thumbs the opposite way. And I like pulling on my thumbs to create space in my clavicles, space in my scapulas. Ground your left foot. Ground your right foot. Really nice. That back thigh is slightly internally rotating. Lift those back ribs. Let's go right into warrior three. Bring your arms forward and let's fly. Dristi is on the ground. If you'd like, stare at one point in front of you. Really nice and stretch. Sparkle those fingertips. Sparkle those toes. Beautiful. Come back to warrior one. Straight arms. Ground your feet. Bring your knuckles down that back thigh. Open up, stretch your throat ever so slightly, and then bow down. Humble warrior. Just relax your head. You don't have to come all the way down. Just a little bit as that outer left hip moves back. Beautiful. Sweep back to warrior one. Reach up, straight arms, look up. Hands at your heart, please. Bring your right upper arm onto your left thigh. Hands in prayer. Just do a little bit of a twist here. You're doing great. Beautiful. Open up to warrior two. Reverse warrior. Go back. Bring your forearm onto your thigh. Reach your right arm up and over. Ground that back leg. The drift is at your pinky. Breathe, really ground your feet. Roll your heart open to the heavens. If you want to bring that left hand to the floor or your left hand to a block, yogi's choice. If this is too much of a hip opener for you, then go ahead and keep that forearm back onto the thigh. Really nice. Sweep back to warrior two. Extend through those arms. And triangle, straighten that leg. Come into triangle. And then go right into straight arm plank. We're going to roll on to the right. I like bringing my left foot forward and really pushing that foot down and reaching up. That gives you a little bit of a break in your shoulders. Really push that left foot into the earth as you reach your left arm over. Really nice. Stay there and breathe. You guys are doing great. Bring the arm back up. Come into straight arm plank, belly button in, straight arms. I like pushing my hands energetically away from each other to spread my collarbones, to create space in my scapulas, the other side. Bring your right foot forward, reach your hand up, look up. Long inhalations and long exhalations and bring the right arm over as you ground your right foot. You can look at your baby, your pinky, and then go ahead and reach up, come back to straight arm plank, belly button in, really nice, let's go ahead and bend the knees down, let's go right into dolphin pose, ground your elbows, you're going to come into downward dog on your elbows while you're looking at your wrists, so come into downward dog, walk your toes in towards your elbows, look at your wrists, and stay there. Beautiful. And then go ahead and bring your feet back. Look straight ahead. Breath of fire. Come on down. 
Let's do a little bit of a cobra. Look up. Child's pose. Take a big inhale. Exhale through the mouth. Ah. Walk your hands off to the right. Bring your left hand onto your right, lengthening the side body. And then back to center. Bring your hands off the yoga mat to the left, bringing your right hand on top of your left, squaring your shoulders. Beautiful. Back to center. We're almost done. Stretch your arms out of your lower waist. You did wonderfully today. We're going to go ahead and come onto our knees and our toes, hands to our buttocks, and just open up. Stretch your throat. Go way back. And then from here, go right to child's pose. And then to camel pose. Child's pose. Really good for the posture. Camel pose. Tailbone down. Bring your thumbs onto your sacrum. If you want to grab your heels, I'm on my toes. Lift your heart, ground your knees, ground your toes, spread your collarbone. Very nice, sit on your heels, knees together, breath of fire. Very nice, we're gonna go ahead and straighten the legs. We're almost done. You guys did great today. Bring your fingertips facing your buttocks. Feet hip distance, lift, go back, stretch your throat. Come down, bring your hands behind your knees. You can keep your knees bent if you'd like, looking up, or you can straighten your legs if you'd like. Reach up and touch your toes. Come back to table, bend your knees, lift your buttocks, knees away from your face back. Navasana boat pose. Straighten your legs or bend your knees. Yogi's choice. Look up. Reach up. Touch your toes. And again, table. Lift. Bring your knees away from your face. And Navasana boat pose. And reach up and touch your toes. I also like finding the back bend and the forward bend, so sometimes I just like lifting into a cobra in the, I like finding the back bend in the forward bend. So delicious. And butterfly, hands behind, lift your heart, spread your collarbones, and come forward. You can bring your heels close to you or away, yogi's choice. And just breathe here. Long inhalations and long exhalations. Really nice. Go ahead and lie back. Hug your knees into your chest. You did wonderfully. Bring your knees over to the right. Just stack your knees. We'll just do a gentle twist. Bring your knees to the right. Back to center, knees to the left. Back to center. Straighten your legs for Navasana. Palms open to the sky. Take a big inhale. And a big exhale. Ah. Let it all go, placing your hands at your heart and your belly. And I want you to go back to a beautiful memory as you breathe in through your heart and your belly. Go back to a beautiful memory. See what you saw. Hear what you heard. And feel what you felt as if you were there right here 
right now. Bathe into those memories. The cells don't know the difference between past, present, or future. Go back to that beautiful memory. Your cells are listening. Your cells are smiling. Your heart is smiling. Your soul is smiling. Your eyes are smiling. Go back to that beautiful memory and stay there as long as you'd like. As long as you'd like. Thank you so much for joining me today for this yoga session. And remember to subscribe and like. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Many blessings. Have a beautiful, blessed day. Namaste.